two frontline trials, they were designed to, uh, to, with a maximum number of treatment cycles beyond chemotherapy. <clears throat> Whereas in the two second line trials, the OCEANS trial and the Aurelia trial, maintenance therapy was continued until disease progression. And uh, the, the major difference in the result of those trials was a, a very significant uh, incremental effect on progression-free survival. So there was about a 50% prolongation of progression-free survival in the second-line trials where bevacizumab was continued until disease progression, whereas the effect in the frontline trials where the uh, extent of treatment was capped at a certain time point was much more modest. And uh, so no one really knows what the right answer is, but, is, but based on all the, weighing all the evidence together uh, and understanding the, the biologic activity and the, and the biology of drugs like bevacizumab, it is only rational to continue the drug until at least disease progression in maintenance um, if it's going to have any la to, uh, lasting benefit. And some would argue even beyond disease progression, which has, has yet to be proven in ovarian cancer, but is suggestive in other solid tumors.